Sveiki visi, čia video man Karlo ir šiandien žaidžiu Fahrenheit Indigo Prophecy Nieko nepamam, nekur baigė, nekai žaist, nes labai sinai, bet kal nuolau, tai prisimykim kartu I finally put all of the pieces together All that's left is to arrest the killer Captain Jones has given us everything we asked for There's no chance of him escaping Opa Okay, this is it. Everybody in position. Copy that. Hello, boss. Oh, shit, I see my mother, shit, I see my daughter. Oh, I get back, shit, I see my daughter. I'll go in first. You cover me. Okay. What the hell is this? Yeah, that's normal. Cover me. I'm gonna check the doors. And I'm into the car. No car, Lucas. That doesn't look very good. Damn, Lucas. What is wrong with you? I'm your Niagara man. We missed him. Well, he's running now. He's running across the street. What should I do, Carla? Stop him. We're coming. Copy that. Oh, it is gonna be Super Saiyan Matrix. It happened again. Somebody died in the lavamatic. I saw it like I was there. Agatha's dead, so who's gonna tell me what's going on? Put your hands in the air! Damn, the police. They already found me. I'll spend the rest of my days rotting in prison, and I'll never find out what really happened. No, it's not gonna happen like that.
that guy just did? Shit, that's crazy. We need to catch him. Next time, he won't get away. Yes, he will. Like fucking Superman right now. Ah, I'm stuck. Five men in the hospital. Four wrecked squad cars. A helicopter that just missed blowing up in our faces. Meanwhile, the killer takes a nice quiet ride on the subway. I hope there's a good explanation for all this. Nothing went according to plan, Captain. The operation was set up by the book and everybody did their jobs, but Kane displayed some abnormal abilities. Just what are you trying to tell me here? That this guy is Superman? That's your excuse? And you seriously expect me to buy that crap? We underestimated Kane. There's no denying it. We knew he was dangerous, but not that he could knock out trained armed policemen and then escape hanging under a helicopter. I don't give a crap about your two-bit excuses. When the press finds out that Kane slipped through our fingers, they're gonna make me a laughingstock. And the mayor's gonna come looking for my head. Now what is the plan, people? Are you on his trail? Kane's photo will be in every squad car, train station, and airport. We're going over every inch of his apartment and interrogating his associates. He can't stay hidden forever. I want every available man on Kane's ass right now. I want him locked up tight in 48 hours or less. You understand me? I want this nut job behind bars before he decides to cut somebody else. Now get out of here! Carla, I've been looking for you. We found some of Kane's prints in an apartment where we found the dead body of an old lady. And that's not all. There was a double murder last night in a lavomatic. One of the two victims was killed by knife blows to the heart. Garrett's already there. He's waiting for you. Lucas. Lucas. Agatha, is that you? Nope. I, I thought you were... Dead. She is dead. In a way. But I promise to tell you what I know. And I always keep my word. Listen carefully, Lucas. We have very little time. You are not insane. Neither are you a murderer. You are simply at the wrong place. At the wrong time. Then who made me commit that murder? Who came and sat down at my table in the restaurant? No one knows his real name. They call him the Oracle. He serves the most powerful of the powerful. They live in shadow, but they have controlled this world since the dawn of time. Why did they make me commit that murder? They've turned you into the instrument of a millennial sacrifice. It's a way for them to see what's hidden. They are looking for a little girl. They'll do anything to get her. They're coming! Save yourself, Lucas! They want your life! A wet knit lad. In the ancient Mayan civilization, you'll find some of the answers you seek there. Agatha? Agatha!
Lucas, wake up. This is a problem. What are you doing here? What happened? The, the police found me. I managed to get away. I walked all night. I, I didn't have anywhere else to go, so I came here. My god. This time you really have to go to the police, Lucas. There is no other solution. I'm not turning myself in until I understand what happened. I saw Agatha again. Here, just a while ago. She, she's dead, but she had some things to tell me. I, I think she wants to help me. Agatha is dead? Are you telling me that you... No, I didn't kill Agatha, Marcus. She was dead by the time I got there. But you're saying that you talked to a dead person? None of this makes any sense. Something strange is happening to me, Marcus. Since the murder, I, I find I can do abnormal things. I see visions of certain events before they happen. Sometimes I can even hear what people are thinking. And my body has become much stronger and faster. Nobody has powers like that. You're not turning into a Superman, Lucas. So what are you going to do? You can't stay here. The police will certainly come to question me, and probably place me under surveillance. I have to find some place to hide. I'm a fugitive. My description will go out everywhere. At least now I know that there is an explanation. I need to find the people who are behind all of this. Be careful, Lucas. They'll kill you if they get the chance. Nothing could be worse than what I see in my visions. Agatha talked about the Mayans. It's vague, but it's all I've got to go on. I've got to find a place to hide while I figure this out. There's only one person who can help me. Minus five degrees Fahrenheit. Every day it got a little colder. The whole city seemed to be numbed by the snow and ice. But nobody was worried about it yet. Go take a look inside, Tyler. I'm gonna talk to Garrett and see if he found anything. Cool with me. I can't even think out here in this damn cold. Ah, I was waiting for you, Carla. So, what happened here? The guy who runs the Lavamatic found the bodies around 5 o'clock this morning when he came to open up. When he tried to get in, it seemed like the door was blocked from the inside. He saw the two bodies through a window and called the cops. Do you think there's a link to Kane? The woman died from three knife wounds to the heart area. It happened in a public place and with no apparent motive. Sound like Kane to you? Were there any prints? Just those of the victims. No prints from Kane, if that's what you're wondering. Thanks, Garrett. stabs in the area of the heart, exactly like the victim in the restaurant. I wouldn't be surprised if the autopsy finds that the arteries were severed. Did you notice this blood over here? Yeah, I saw that. What do you think it means? That the murderer was bleeding before he stabbed his victim. Just like in the toilets of the restaurant. Bizarre. 
Why is there blood here? A knife stuck in his eye. Death would have been instantaneous. Bizarre. His wrists are all cut up. Looks like some kind of symbol carved on them. Snake. Snake with two heads. Let's go. I've seen enough. What are we supposed to think about this murder? A guy committed suicide after killing the woman? It seems absurd, but it's the only explanation. I don't think Kane had anything to do with what happened at the Laundrette. But, all the same, there's got to be a link between the two murders. I had nowhere to go. I was exhausted. I felt like I was going to die, either from the cold or from hunger. I hoped that I could rest for a couple of hours at Tiffany's place, get my energy back, and figure out what to do next. I'd only been to her new apartment once before. I only had... Watching Tiffany's apartment, of course. They assumed that I'd show up here looking for a place to hide. I have to find another way in. Another place? Police. There must be some way to get around. Видно, надо что так его на крест. Ну, да, лайк он не что он должен был очень говорить на Марин до сидела.
da war leicht zu gehen. Nimm das mal zu That window leads to Tiffany's apartment. If only I could find a way to open it. I think it budged a little. It's open a few inches. God, there's no way it's stuck. I wasn't too proud about breaking into Tiffany's apartment like a common criminal, but I had no choice. I hadn't eaten in almost a day. I was starting to feel weak and tired. Oh shit, Shuttle. Ah, the Maestro the Maestro. Oh shit. Vikram Spalov. Mirayana Pawalik. No, we can't. What the fuck? Oh, we built a garden. Extremely cold temperatures remain the top story today, with the thermometer dropping to a new record low of minus 15 degrees. Heavy snowfall caused the temporary closing of the Brooklyn Bridge. And sadly, the cold proved fatal for several homeless persons in Harlem and in the Bronx. Europe has not been spared either. Record lows have been registered in numerous countries. Mysterious restaurant murder has been a Fuck. And for an expert's point of view on the subject, 
Uh, we have with us today one of the most renowned specialists on Mayan civilization, Professor Dmitry Kuryakin of the Mesoamerican University here in New York. Uh, thanks for being with us today, Professor. You've written a fascinating book on Mayan rituals. And uh, I wanted to ask you if... A specialist in Mayan civilization? He'd known what Kekniklan means. Gotta meet this Professor Kuryakin. I'm out of danger for now. I'll wait for Tiffany to get back before I leave. Around you. Ash, I'm not going to do it. Eu paguei, eu já paguei, eu tenho que apostar o sol, eu... Ah lá, é isso lá. Surprise, mano. Fuck off. You scared me. What are you doing here? The police are looking for me. I needed a place to hide for a few hours. Lucas, what happened to you? The papers are saying that you killed several people. Is it true? <sighs> the whole thing is very complicated. All I can tell you is that I am not a murderer. I love you, Lucas. I don't want to lose you. Lucas, it's the police. What are we gonna do? Look, I'm sure they just want to ask you a few questions. Just stay calm, Tiffany, and answer their questions. I'll I'll hide in the apartment. Everything will be fine. You'll see. Okay, so good. Miss Hopper? Miss Hopper, are you home? <laughs> yes. <laughs> just a second. I'm coming. Lucas, I can't keep them waiting anymore. I've got to open the door. Miss Harper? Yes? I'm Detective Todd of Miles NYPD. I'm working on the Lucas Kane case. I think that you two were romantically involved, isn't that right? We're involved, yes. But we separated. We broke up about a month ago. Have you heard from Mr. Kane recently? Has he tried to contact you? I went by his apartment day before yesterday to pick up the last of my things. We hardly spoke. I haven't heard from him since. Do you mind if I look around your apartment? Well, it's just that... Hey, I'll only be a minute. Go ahead. Doing a little redecorating? Yes, the apartment wasn't in very good shape, so I've been painting it. It's taking a long time with my job. I don't have much time to... And what do you do? I'm a nurse. I work at St. John's Hospital.
What happened to your window here? Oh, that. I broke the glass while moving some furniture last night. The window repairman promised to stop in today, but I guess he forgot me. Thank you for your cooperation, miss. <laughs> if Kane does try to recontact you, please call me right away. Here's my card. Be careful, miss. Kane's a very dangerous man. Okay, Chabus Cancer is a video. Taigi, man, o šiam video užteks. Čia buvo video man Karla ir stiksim kitam video. Bye, peace out.